All right, Andy, Christmas music before or after Thanksgiving? Definitely after Thanksgiving. I'm so glad we could agree on this one thing. Now let's get into the news. Millers, if you brought toys for the toy drive, please drop off to the toys in Mrs. Gilbert's room in 2210. Last day to drop off toys is December 3rd. Remember, toys are needed for kids that are infants to people who are 18 years old. The Miller Reader Club participants have a new book for you. Stop by the library to receive your copy of A Madness So Discreet by Mindy McGinnis. They will have their first meeting over the book on December 1st. See Ms. Gellert if you have any questions. Now on to trending today. The new Ghostbusters movie Afterlife is out now, starring Finn Wolford and McKenna Grace. The movie follows a single mother and her two kids when they move to a new town, and they soon discover they have a connection to the original Ghostbusters and the secret legacy that their grandfather left behind. See your Ghostbusters Afterlife at the local movie theaters. Lend a, pl lend a paw club members, don't forget your bake a treat meeting on December 7th. If you're interested, fill out the treat, fill out the treat interest form on the LAPC Canvas page. Remember, in order to participate in the meeting, you must have at least three hours of volunteer time or have donated at least two items to an animal shelter. Now let's toss it over to sports. All right, Millers, it's time for your favorite segment of the week, sports. On Saturday, the girls' basketball team won against Homestead 69-48. to Shout out to Ashlyn Shade, who led Noblesville with 26 points, and Caitlin Shoemaker, who contributed 12 points. They are 5-0-4 the season, and, ca and catch them on Tuesday as they go up against Carmel. The wrestling team took home the trophy from the Hamilton Heights Super 6. It was a tough battle, but the Millers edged out the Huskies in a close score of 28-26. to Thanks to sophomore Austin Hashings, who went undefeated and had a pin in his last match worth six points, helping lead the Millers to a victory. Also, congrats to Gage goalie Carter Richardson, Jacob Long, and Jacob Etchardson, who also went undefeated. Catch the JV team at the, at the Westfield Round Robin tonight at 5.30. Now let's head over to Pro Sports. LeBron James was ejected from the Los Angeles Lakers and Detroit Pistons game after drawing blood on Isaiah Stewart's face while they were trying to get a position for a rebound off of a free throw. It was a hard hit, but while LeBron tried to apologize to Stewart, Stewart tried to charge at LeBron. It was a messy encounter and ultimately left LeBron James fans upset over the brawl that broke out, out and left their favorite player being kicked from the game. This upcoming Tuesday, the Junior Varsity Wrestling is going against Westfield at 5.30 at Westfield High School. The girls' Junior Varsity and Freshman Basketball is playing Carmel on Tuesday at 6 at Carmel High School. The girls and boys of Varsity Swimming and Diving Team have a meet at Hamilton South Eastern High School at 6 on Tuesday. The girls' Varsity Basketball play Carmel High School at 7.30 on Tuesday at Carmel High School. On Wednesday, the boys' Junior Varsity Basketball plays at home against Lawrence North High School at 6. And the boys' varsity basketball team plays Lawrence North at home this Wednesday at 7.30. That's all we have for today, Millers. For more, check out millermedianow.org or youtube.com slash NHS News. We hope everyone has a fantastic break. We'll see you next week, NHS. Peace.